Hello, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Too Cool for School. Uh, this is a comedy podcast where we discuss with each other, well, uh, very questionable dilemmas, pushing us to the very edge. Uh, allow me to, to introduce here my guests. Uh, with me today, I have Lainey. Lainey, please say hello to the people. Hello, internet people. <laughs> I also have with myself and Lainey a voice over your shoulder. If you'd like to say hello to the people on the computer. Hello, computer people. <laughs> I hope you guys are as ready as I am, which is not a little, to another round of questionable dilemmas. So what do you guys think? Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm good to go. Uh, it's been a while here, so I hope you guys are ready. And uh, who should go first? Who volunteers himself as a tree boat or herself? <laughs> I volunteer voice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm good to go. I'm yeah, perfectly yeah. fine being volunteered. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Go ahead, voice, then. Uh, the, the stage is yours. Bring okay. your dilemma here. And uh, let's hope for the best. <laughs> All right, so mine was inspired by the stupid, crazy Powerball uh, number from last weekend or last week. Oh, I, I yeah, heard there was so, a major jackpot, right? Yeah, it was over two billion dollars. Oh, that Jesus Christ. One person in California, one person in California Holy pulled the ticket. Shit. So they're... Yeah, the cash value is probably like it was like either just under a billion or before taxes. Before, before. Exactly, exactly. Um, Damn. Wow. All right. Let's go for it. So, yeah. All right. So, you get that $2 billion, but your contact info, your social media is always going to be on the public eye. You are basically, you have a toll free number that goes directly to your cell phone. Your Facebook is public, so you have no control over who reaches out to you at any time. Your phone is probably gonna be ringing off the hook if you have one. Um, any social media, any phone number, any email address, it is always visible to the public. So you have no privacy on those things if you have them. The only way that you could potentially get around it is by having an assistant, but still, they'd be basically the go-between between you and anything else. You would have no access to being able to call anyone. I mean, you could have access to call people directly, but your phone's going to be ringing off the hook. You would be able to take no incoming calls, basically. Okay. Uh, so, no privacy. You have all the money that you could possibly need. Two billion dollars. But utterly no privacy when it comes to social media or contact information. Or, the alternative would be you get a magical pencil or drumstick, basically something that you can just tap. And every time you tap this, and let's just say drumstick, it drops a nickel. And so it can't be mechanized. It has oh, to be that's you what I was just about to say. <laughs> yeah. I'm a bit confused. What do you mean drumstick? Yeah. Uh, like. Like, like a like um, a drumstick for like a, playing literally music. literally like a drumstick. Like a, uh, okay, literally okay. A drumstick. I thought this was a word for something else. I was getting very confused. <laughs> yep. yep. No, it's just literally a drumstick or a, something that's just kind of like a pencil or a drumstick that you're just sitting here and you're just tapping on a desk. Okay. Every time you tap, it drops a nickel. It has to be done by a human hand. But I actually did the math. If you did that once a second for eight hours a day. That's a little over $1,400 a day. And so for eight hours a day for five days a week, I believe that's a little under $29,000 a month in nickels. Whoa. So you would, yeah, you would be, and that's just once a second. And you can tap a lot quicker than once a second if you wanted to, but it has to be you that taps that, taps that thing. And 
you have a whole bunch of loose change. So you'd have to put them in Hold a bucket, that. take them to the bank, or roll them yourself, which it, whichever's no. easiest for you. I used to have the roll but... change all the time. I hated it. It was <laughs> the worst. <laughs> So I've seen, like I've seen product. some, um, yeah. oh, sorry, sorry, quick, keep continue. Oh, I was just gonna, I was just gonna say, you still have your privacy. No one knows that you have this magical pencil or drumstick. Fuck okay. But you have to work for it. That's, ah, uh, I, I, I was gonna say, I always had this, um, fantasy, you know, um, I've seen some a ASMR videos where people go with these huge, massive jars of coins and they just drop into one of those coin machines that then give you a check, uh, 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 a check or whatever, uh, to, to, to withdraw the money. Oh, that will be so satisfying though. But in nickels. That, that's like but oh, that's like a massive amount to, to even make a slighter difference. <laughs> um, that's interesting. <sighs> what are your thoughts, Lainey? I very much value my privacy. <laughs> I'm the same. I'm the same. I'm the same. Um, I mean. Ugh. Because uh, you said it's any number you have, so it's not like you can have like a different phone because it's any number you own, anything yep. registered to you. Um, the moment you open up a new email address, the moment you start a new phone line, it gets put out in the public eye. People know that every they know every single way to get hold of you. Is it like now all your data is compromised? Mm. Just like, like here, uh, they get contact compromise. information, mm. how to get a hold of you. Yeah. Okay. Still like, okay. like you have a website. Like they don't have access to my messages, kind of to my. No, no, no. It's just like no. how to get a hold of you. No. So like email, no. uh, any kind of social media you have where you can message somebody, anything like that. So it's just yep. contact you. Hmm. Uh, you have all your privacy settings on your social media are open. or are just marked as public. So you anyone that wants to get a hold of you can. That's that's tough. That's tough. Um I could the, the thing is like I, I I already don't use social media whatsoever, so that could be one point. Can I just ignore social media altogether? Because I have social I mean, media. Yeah. I have social but media, it's, but, but it's, it's more like a messaging service for me, you know? Yeah, but then it's your, your phone number as well. <clears throat> yeah. And that messaging service, you'd be getting just flooded with messages of people asking for money. Can we still turn notifications off? Like, oh, yeah. On our. I mean, you can okay, turn so we would just off, not but... see it. We could just not see it. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, That'd be I would you probably tell people... just. I would probably just uninstall those apps from my phone at that point. That way, the messages wouldn't even come through because. And then you can also on. set you can also set the settings on your phone not to receive any phone calls or, me or and block any messages from numbers that you don't have saved on your phone. No, I think it's a I think it's an option. Yeah, you can. It has like, to. It has yeah. to. Yeah. So but basically, with that, I, but that wouldn't count though, right? Board. You couldn't block the phone calls from coming in, right? Because you that's can. It would be set to you open. Are, I, I, I'm confused. I, I'm confused right. because yeah. I know yeah. I, I, I'm a hundred percent certain that you can block anonymous calls. But no, that's I mean call... according to the rules, because if all of your settings, if all of your contact yeah. settings have to be set to open, hmm. that like setting your phone then to like mute that would if you're, yeah if you're messing with the technology yeah that would then that kind yeah of that would go it. against the rule of so like having the, open contact the <sighs> only way around it that i could think of that that i was willing to accept is if you hire right. an assistant so they would just have to like hold your phone that they filter everything that they have to they deal with the ringing phone and they're the ones that recognize Oh, this is your, this is your friend. This is whomever, and then they come to you, and they're like, "Here, here's your line," and then they. 
you can talk to that person and then you have to give the phone back. I mean, so that you have money, so you have the money to, to hire an assistant, so. Yeah, I mean, you could hire as right. many as you wanted to, to be able to just keep track of your stuff for you, so. Or have your privacy and have a magical drumstick that you can just sit there and tap all day long. Which, because I was sitting there, my mentality was once a second, which would be like one Mississippi, two Mississippi, and you could sit there and go da 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 da, da all day yeah, long. Yeah, if you just like you hold it make... between your fingers and flick it back and forth, like, it would tap. Well, I mean, that, I mean, that sounds like private time, lady, but just holding between your fingers and flicking it back and forth. I'm just but... saying. No, yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. Just saying. I have practice. No, it's can... fine. I would do well. Yeah. You could, yeah. you could probably get closer to a hundred thousand in cash a month if you were really, really. Well, and my thing is, is, you wouldn't have to do it every mm -hmm. day either. If you dedicated, like, if you dedicated like a couple of days and did it all day long, and then took a couple of days off, mm. yep. you would probably. And yeah, no, I'm picking that because you know what? That's more sustainable because then you would have it forever. So anytime, anytime you need, like, like you, you only right, yeah, you, yeah. Because it's the same thing of like, okay, so you know how the the whole thing of like, oh, you get three wishes, what you, what would you wish for? My like, people always wish for like a specific amount of money. My wish would be to always have the exact right change for any purchase I make. So therefore, I always have exactly the right amount of money yeah. that I need, not mm. a finite amount of money. So I would take the drumstick because then I could do like, like I said, like four days where it's like, okay, I'm gonna tap this all day long. As long as I'm awake, I'm gonna be tapping And just picture this. like, guys, and it, it's like the coolest, it's the coolest ma magic trick ever, you know? Let right? me show you this cool trick, you know? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I mean, for me, the way I see it, it's like uh, you either get that uh, close to one billion after tax, right? And you go completely off the grid. Otherwise, uh, people are going to harass the, the living hell out of you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No matter what you try. I don't think there is any... Unless you go off the grid and you completely leave your phone and your social media and everything. Uh, yeah. People will still, and, and and even so, if people want to find you, they might still be able to find you. You know what I mean? Right. And yeah. on the other hand, you can practice to be um, John Bonham, a fantastic uh, drummer. <laughs> right? Like uh, any any Led yeah. Zeppelin fans, uh, I'll be like John Bonham. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Here we go. You, you did the math, right? How much is it a day you can make if you do a second? If you just for do eight one hours. Second, it's for eight hours, it's a little over fourteen hundred. So fourteen, fourteen forty US. That, that's that's more than uh, Jesus Christ. That's, that's would, more than right, I'll ever need. That's a day, right? Exactly. That's more than that's I'll ever need. Thing. That's more than I'll ever yeah. need. And and, yeah. and you you make double if you're John Bonham as well. So yeah. Oh, you could easily make double. Like you could get what. Like if you're really quick on it, I, I mean, I'm not a percussionist, but I'm sure you could easily get at least four beats a second, if not more. So you could easily make mm. four or five times more. So, exactly, exactly. So yeah, uh, I, I, as, as Lainey said, I value very much my privacy. So I would go with yeah. the second option. I will become the best drummer in the world. <laughs> in the world. <laughs> in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I don't know how to play drums, so I don't play anything. Did you but... touch my drum set? I know you touched my drum set. <laughs> Can you lose it? Can people steal it from you? Is it... Uh... Well, you don't Usually. have to tell it. Well, it's, mean, just, you... it's just a drumstick. Yeah, right. so I mean, if you were to misplace it, then you're you're fucked. Uh, it's yeah. just, it's one of those things. Uh... That's when you tie a string yeah. to it and then yeah. tie that yeah. to your wrist yeah. and you just keep it forever. Yeah. <laughs> just uh, have a surgery, uh, keep it to <laughs> itself, I don't know, somehow. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I, 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 I would hand, I would handle that stick very close to me, if you know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, uh, what would you choose, voice? Ah, uh, in all honesty, I would have no problem just saying fuck it to phone and social media. Okay. Like two billion dollars, I'm like, because I know it is a finite amount of money, but two billion dollars 
I'd have no problem just completely walking away from social media, completely walking away from everything, and disappearing. Like, yeah. my wife and I were both loners, so we would both just kind of just say, fuck it, and just leave. Okay, and okay. No, no one would have any idea Go where we were. completely off the grid, then. Yeah. No, that's fair, that's fair, that's fair. I would still like to reasonably lead my comfortable life, you know? My normal life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I think yeah. I value it very much. Uh, and without privacy, your your life is simply ceases to be normal, I would say. And I like normal. I, I, I'm too normal, you know, to... <laughs> okay. Um... Do you, can I go next, lady, or do you want to go? Yeah. Ladies first, no, I don't go. mind. No, yeah. No, no, no. No, no. All right then. <laughs> so, um, two possible scenarios here. Which one should I start with? Okay. So, uh, as we are all fellow streamers here, right? Uh, I come up with a, a nice uh, streaming dilemma. Um, so, on the first option. Uh, on one of your streams, um, at some point you uh, you would have to let you, you you would have to have uh, you have to let one slip, okay? A nice uh, frosty fart. Uh, I, I like the word frosty. I I, I got this from the last episode uh, voice. <laughs> I got something about it. So on one of your streams, uh, you would have to let one slip, and you have to say live on stream, on your camera. Fuck, I think I shorted myself. And then you would have to upload the VOD, okay, without any cuts, uh, just that simple raw footage of you uh, saying I shorted myself after a big nice fart. And every time you are questioned about this episode in particular, you can only reply shit happens. Okay? You can never add anything to explain that situation for the rest of your life. Okay? So this is something you don't need you don't necessarily need to shart, okay? You just have a nice long fart and then you say on camera, fuck, I think I sharted myself. And then upload the VOD and no questions asked. If, if anyone in, in 20 years from now, wherever you are in life, someone picks up that video and asks, what the hell was this? And you can only, the only reply you can say is, shit happens. Okay? This is the first option. Okay. The second option okay. is you'd get stuck for 72 hours on a lift. Okay? Uh, for 72 hours, you will be stuck on a lift with Andrew Tate and a Chihuahua. Uh, is the Chihuahua nice? Uh, we don't know. It's a Chihuahua. It can go very well or it can go very wrong. Yeah, I have a scar on my pinky from my, from my <laughs> Nam's Chihuahua. And I was playing fetch with that little bitch. She bit me. <laughs> she brought me her ball. I picked it up and then she bit me. So, so yeah, uh, you're stuck for 72 hours in a lift with Andrew Tate and a Chihuahua. In the background, you can listen to the album of Enya on replay. I mean... And Andrew Tate would fill uh, the uncomfortable silences with motivational speeches and hints and tips on home decor. Can I hit... Andrew can you take the Tate. Short video. <laughs> can you what? <laughs> can I hit him? Uh, you're stuck with him for 72 hours. You can hit him, but I'm pretty sure taking I can in take consideration him. his personality, I'm not. Can I you take him? <laughs> he's a I'm he's a sure kickboxer, right? Him. I think he's I a. I can kick too. Okay. 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 I, I think I'm sure he. I'm sure. Kick <laughs> no, and I mean just. It's in that situation, I'm not stuck in right, there with him. Right, he's stuck in there with he's me. He's stuck in there with me. Right. Yeah. Exactly. So, I'm like, me, I'm not too worried, because pound for pound, I'm like, I probably make two of them. But, no, it's... I feel like yeah, I actually, could make... I think be... I would take the time to just make that man miserable. <laughs> he would deserve it. 
I'm gonna choose. I'm terrified of elevators, <laughs> but like I choose the elevator just so I can torture him, and possibly pee on his shoe. It's fine. I'll blame the shower. <laughs> exactly, because you need to consider all your uh, physiologic necessities, right? Seventy-two hours. Uh, oh yeah, there's yeah. definitely gonna yeah. have to be a poop yeah. corner. There's gonna be a poop corner, a pee corner. There's gonna be a poop corner. <laughs> While listening to Enya on the background, okay. I, I hey, I like Enya, so yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I just think I don't I think love, that'll be too bad. I love Enya. I, I just think the whole Enya thing would, 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 would bring <laughs> yeah. would, would just bring everything together. You know, the whole experience together. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I could make Andrew Tate miserable. Like, because, okay, so when he does his, like, podcasts and shit, he's in a controlled environment that he controls, right? But yeah. in this, he wouldn't yeah. have that. I mean... Like, he wouldn't have, I like, mean, his, like, last men behind him backing him up for all the terrible shit that he says, because he's a pig. Uh, I'm pretty sure I could make that man feel real bad about himself. Oh, uh, it would it would be an interesting thing to watch. Maybe we can set up a camera on the lift. <laughs> <laughs> there are cameras. There's a camera. Um, we could still just be like, can I get the security camera after? Right. Can I get the footage of that? At least that, I'm sure. Going going back to the first option as well. Uh, then again, it would imply uh, in the future. Let's say, and I, and I seriously hope so, uh, we c one of us can make it big, you know? Uh, but that's gonna be always the thing that could hold you back. You know how people are obsessed constantly no, to no, find dirt on everyone else. You lean into it, and you'll be like, I'm the shark girl. That will like, become your thing. Well, that will become your thing. Right, you just lean into it. We can't it. make... You can't, can't give any... to the video. You, it, it's and the raw footage. You no cuts, edits. no edits, okay. no uh, just uh, that section where you throw a big fart on stream, a saucy fart, and you say, saucy. fuck, I, shart I think I sharted myself. You don't necessarily need to shart, okay? Uh, you just need but to you say just, it. Right? it. You just say it. Like you say it. You, slip some, then... you slip one out, you say it, and then you upload the VOD, raw footage, no cuts, and then uh, all my vods upload anyway so. for the rest of your life if anyone questions what happened there you just say shit, shit happens happen. shit happens because i would love to just make one edit to just fuck i think i showed it myself wah, 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 wah. And just the, <laughs> the, the trombone uh like, i see i see you, could you, always, you were trying you to could do the joker make, the joker edit always, so people would say yeah, oh, you it's could not always true make that clip you can always take that oh, clip no. and like upload it and shit. Mm, not not yeah. the case. No no edits, raw footage only. No 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 no. I'm saying Working like the... you have that footage, yeah. but then you could take that clip and like just that clip and then upload it to like TikTok and like make it a thing. Oh yeah yeah. Oops, I yeah, sharded. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You could really lean into that. Ah. <sighs> But I think so, I'm still gonna take the Andrew Tate thing because as you as really want to take on I'm not Andrew stuck Tate. in there with him. He's stuck in there with me. <laughs> and there's a puppy. That's just a bonus. I don't know about you guys, but I uh, I love pets. I love animals. But Chihuahua, I, I I I don't I don't see Chihuahua as a pet. I would get it's, a it's, Chihuahua. It's an absolute. It's a rat. It's a rat. I like rats too. I've had one. <laughs> His name was Nibbler, and he was cute. Aww. He was a sweet boy. Oh, I... I trained him to um. I trained him to sleep in a teacup. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, he no. was cute. He was cute. <laughs> if it's domesticated, I guess it will be all right. Um, just going back to the Chihuahua thing is just too. It's it's more noise than a dog itself, in my opinion. Most of the time, that's very true. <laughs> they're really cute when they're young too. When they get old, they just they they look rabid. Oh my god, sure. they, they are absolutely rabid. It's like the tiniest noise. Uh, they just burst. <laughs> they just burst completely. And it's an, it's not like it's a nice smooth bark. 
it, it's no. just it's it's, it's annoying. It's not the scream bark. It's it's horrible. Well, I mean, I have a pug right now, so like I don't think a, a chihuahua is too much difference in the noise. Uh, in the mm. in the noise of the bark, because my pug when he barks, it it literally sometimes it sounds like one of my children and i'm like oh my god and i'm like oh never mind it's just charlie <laughs> <laughs> all right uh, so no. shall we go for the lift or shall we go for the shard what are your I'm thoughts i'm going for the lift i'm taking e the lift I, I already saw your decision there laney you are go was, going for andrew Tate. i made it you, I made it. I'm going you after are ready to go after Andrew Tate. You probably take some boxing lessons or kickboxing <laughs> before you go. You take I a bucket with it. you for the poop corner. The same thing is when <laughs> it was the Donald Trump thing. We get to beat the shit out of Donald Trump. Like, I'm, it's the same thing. I'm sold. I'm sold. <laughs> oh my god. What about you, boys? Honestly, I think I would take the shark video. <laughs> Because <laughs> that would, I mean, that, I, I have no shame. So, right. And it's, it's, that's one of those. And literally, the only response you can give is, shit happens. That would be fucking hilarious. That's funny. It's like, so you sharded on video. Yeah, shit happens. And just, you <laughs> roll with it. You just don't, you don't register. And it would be so easy. Like, yeah, you have that raw video out there. It's just like, oh, fuck, I sharded. That that's always something so nice to show to the family later happen. on as well. <laughs> yeah, that too, that too. But it would be so easy to just make, like, you can't change that right. footage, but it would be so easy to just make TikTok. Yeah, to leak into and it and make it a whole joke. Goofy, yeah. Just being all like, yeah, and like lean into it, like, wait a second. And being like, like I, I, the only downside is I'm like, oh, I wouldn't, I, because like you'd be able to get away with saying I'm Tub Girl 2.0. But, like, I wouldn't be able to get away with that. But, um, tub, tub guy. <laughs> I'm, sh I'm shirt man. <laughs> yeah, I, I personally, I personally, I think I would go with a shirt myself, too. I, I'll be honest. It's just... Oh, a t-shirt that says, I, I jumped the shirt. Um, so, just, I jumped the shirt, have that kind of merchandise. That would be great. It's just that I, I'm I'm terribly afraid that uh, Andrew Tate would just push me to the edge, to the limits. You know, I hate conf confrontation. I absolutely hate confrontation. But being stuck with him on a lift for seventy-two hours, uh, talking about motivational speeches and and home decor, uh, <laughs> at, at some point I'm gonna burst. And I don't know. I'm afraid. I'm afraid that I'm gonna. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know. I, I'm afraid <laughs> that will happen. And there, there probably be uh, the shit flying around, uh, the bucket flying around. <laughs> oh my word! He said, "I'm gonna fling my shit, and I don't yeah. care." <laughs> Ch Chihuahuas flying around. I don't know. I don't know what. <laughs> Does he, does Andrew Tate need to be alive at the end of the <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately so. Unfortunately so. so. Yeah. Um, okay. So yeah, okay. Uh, we got two shorters and and uh, and <laughs> one lady facing... The, w w one lady has more <laughs> balls than all of us combined, okay? <laughs> uh, yeah. Facing Andrew Tate. All right. That's a good one. Yeah. So Lenny... Shall you continue with our dilemmas? Very yes, questionable yes. dilemmas. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, would you rather give up... Um, so, you would only be allowed to eat bland foods, like oatmeal or, like, bread or, you know, very bland foods for the rest of your life. Or give up sex. I hate you so much, girl. I, I know. hate you. Like you why you food. you always pick the topic oh, of no. food. Like this is my <laughs> soft corner, you know? I, I can't. I can't deal with this. <sighs> yeah. 
Um, so it's not all food, obviously, because we can't live without eating, but it would have to be like bland foods forever. Like. Okay. Oh, so, so like okay. English cooking. Would you, did you say like English <laughs> cooking? It's very so true. It just has to be true. bland flavored food. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Bangers it's and mash. <laughs> bangers but, and like, mash. Um, like, yeah. so, sex. Like, uh, so does, that, does that include masturbation? Yep. Jesus Christ. All forms of sex. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's unhealthy. Food. That's I like know, literally I unhealthy. I would just. Well, I mean. Hmm. Yeah, I would just. Yeah, I would just. Yeah. I'd be perfectly. Well, I mean, I would. I, I'd still eat. You could still eat a perfectly normal diet. It, it would, would all be bland. bland. So, like, like you no could have like nothing. a hamburger, yeah. but no seasoning, no condiments, just a hamburger on bread. Eat. Yeah. Uh... Yeah. I, I would be perfectly because my wife. Would <laughs> so. Yeah, I think I would do. I mean, if you s the definition of bland is just like no seasonings, no uh, just bland food. You can say a burger on a bun. Is that still considered bland then? Yeah. So like, n like literally no seasonings, no condiment, no flavor, just the food as is cooked and then on your plate oh i would have to stop eating chicken that's so that's a bummer you would just well, eat could, regular chicken you could eat the chicken you would just be no salt no pepper no i'm just saying no I, I, I couldn't <laughs> uh, uh, like the chicken is so bland if unless it's seasoned like that's that's pure yeah. bland there is no flavor like beef or yeah. pork you can still get some flavor to it you know you have fat uh, but chicken without any seasonings, oh. I, I think I would still go for the food, though. So. <laughs> you, you could always just burn it. I mean, there's no seasoning. You could just char there the you go. fuck out of it. <laughs> Crispy. <laughs> Crunchy. Uh, I hate when you touch the food. Uh, okay, you know what? I, I, I've got a nice dilemma saved for you next episode. Oh, I, I've got no, a nice is it the one? one. You uh, it's it's the one. 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 I've been holding back on this, you know, but you are just pushing me to the edge now. <laughs> Sorry, my cat just had his claws stuck in my. He was like stuck there. <laughs> what are you doing? You okay? I like looked over at my camera and I just saw him stuck. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> oh man, it's uh, the one though. It's the one you talked about. It's the, the very one. First it's episode. the one. It's the one. Uh, 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 next episode is going to be a good one. Yeah. Um, oh, this is hard. This is really hard. I, that might not be what well, he says, depending on what food. you pick. But, um, it's food, Lainey. You can't make fun with food. And I also you cannot make fun with blue balls. That's not fun at all. That's not fun at all. You can put your blue balls in your purple jumpsuit. <laughs> either, you, either you have blueberries or you have blue balls. Blue balls on a purple jumpsuit. Okay, what do you think, voice? Sure, I'd be eating the bland food. I'm like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if the yeah. spiciest... I would take it that the the, the, uh, the the tasty thing that I'm eating is my wife. That would be... I can deal with that. So. Mm. Mm -mm. Well, I think, I think I'll go with the bland food as well. I, I was worried in the beginning because when you saw bland, when you said bland food, I thought we can only eat like, uh, it's like really bland, like wheat or, you know, uh, you mentioned uh, porridge, uh, so oats, uh, like proper, just like cereal kind of food, you know? Uh, no, you can still have a normal diet, just no seasonings, no condiments, no nothing ever. So like nothing on it. Ever. Yeah, yeah. My, I think my taste buds would be screaming for help for the first couple of months, but then they would just get into it. 
They have to. They have to. They have to. <laughs> I've done the all fluid, like, because of surgery, I had to do an all fluid diet. So it was really like, and after a couple of weeks, you actually get, starting to get used to it. So Yeah. Hmm. It's boring as fuck, but you don't really crave anything. The worst similar thing I had to go through was uh, when I removed my tonsils. Mm -hmm. uh, I For like, I think it was 12 days or 14 days, I could only eat cold soup and ice cream. Oh god. Yeah. It, uh, the ice cream part was fun the first two days, but oh my god, like... Uh, I didn't eat ice cream for like two, three months after that. <laughs> it was just I'm not a big ice cream person. That sounds awful. Oh. So yeah, what what would you choose, uh, Lainey? Oh, I'm choosing sex. Easy. <laughs> That's easy, and I'd probably lose some weight. So uh, both are pluses. <laughs> you would lose some weight. What do you mean with? With no sex? If you're, if you're only eating bland food. No, but she oh, would she, choose I'm, the sex. She's choosing to do the bland food. So right, she meaning, so she meaning I'm only going to be eating bland food. Ah, okay, okay, sorry, I sorry, sorry. Lose okay, okay, no, I, I misunderstood that. So, yeah, yeah, I guess uh, we could all lose a few pounds. Uh, little side effects. Small sacrifices for a greater good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I think we can kind of uh, come to an agreement, at least on this one. Um, right, I think this yeah. is the first one where we've all chosen the same yeah. thing. Yeah, we, we just went for it. Yeah. <laughs> like, we all chose like, the same thing. No sex? Fuck that. <laughs> right, we're out. <laughs> 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 Alright guys, uh, thank you so much. Uh, I think we can wrap things up. Uh, thanks again as well for coming. Thanks for all the viewers who participated today. Uh, it's always a nice pleasure. Uh, we stream uh, every Sunday, at least we try to, <laughs> every Sunday <laughs> at 6pm uh, uh, BST or 1pm EST. Uh, so feel free to join us on another round of Dilemmas uh, next week. You can also join us on socials. We have episodes uh, uploaded on, on YouTube with some nice animations to it. Uh, and if you, we always encourage as well all the viewers, if you'd like to participate, to send your own dilemmas or even to join us um, as a special guest on this stream, uh, feel free to do so uh, using any of the socials below. Thanks to, thanks to all, everyone, especially thanks to uh, my dear guests here. Laney and voice and have a good one. I'll see you next week. <laughs> Bye.